Yo, what's up everyone? Buzzy Beth here. Today, let's learn how to make a dance GUI. So a GUI where anytime we click on a certain button, uh, animation plays. So inside of our starter GUI, let's go ahead and add a screen GUI. Inside of this screen GUI, let's go ahead and add a frame. And then we're gonna go ahead and customize this GUI. I'm gonna add a UI corner. So I have about four animations that I want to add. So what I'm gonna do is add four text buttons. So a text button for each animation. If you have more animations, then feel free to add more. And then in each text button, we're going to go ahead and add an animation object. Now in this animation object for each text button, make sure you pa uh, paste the animation ID that you would like to use. So don't forget that, that's very important. So once that's also done, go ahead and rename your text buttons to whatever animation that you are using. For me, I'm just using DJ Dance, Flip. Um, let's go ahead and do Arm Wave. And then the last text button is going to be a running animation. Perfect. And don't forget to paste your animation ID in their respective animation objects. Oh, one more thing. I'm gonna go ahead and actually add one more text button. And this text button is going to stop anim to stop any animation that is playing. And I'm gonna go ahead and rename that to stop anim. And it does not have an animation object inside of it. So let's go ahead and add a local script inside of our frame. Okay, so we have a few variables. The first one, which references the frame itself, we have a three variables which checks to see if it's a player or a character added inside of the game and if they are then it's going to be a humanoid checking if they are humanoid and then we have our variables to load our animations which we pasted inside of our animation object and then we're gonna go ahead and create a function for each text button so starting off with the first animation for me it's DJ dance so I'm gonna do frame dot DJ dance dot mouse button one click connect function and before I want to play any of the animations I'm gonna go ahead and stop any of the three other possible animations that may be playing so the flip animation the arm wave as well as the running so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, call those animations to a stop I'm gonna do task dot wait and then I'm going to play the DJ dance or DJ anim animation and I'm going to do the same thing for the rest of the other functions. So what I mean by this is, let's go ahead, go to our next function, our flip function, right? So you see how on our three, I'm stopping the three animations that might that may be playing. I'm gonna do task.wait and then play the flip animation. And then go ahead and do that for however many animation uh, ID that you have, animation objects that you have. Okay, so let's go ahead and test out our script and look at that. I'm gonna do a flip, let's do an arm wave running so cool and then I can stop the animation if I want so full scripts and models will be posted on our website link in the description down below if you guys enjoyed this content please give us a like and a subscribe as always have fun creating and I'll catch you guys in the next video peace